In this video, I'm going to share with you people a planning engineer job role. As a planning engineer, how are you going to fit for the industries going to hire you next two or three months? Yes, you heard it rightly that next two or three months, you can make it happen for yourself. What you need to do, I'm going to describe step by step. First thing, you have to start learning skills as per industry demand project planning and control engineer actually first of all to help you people you can search it on linkedin as a planning engineer and you can find there many jobs among those jobs you can find job responsibilities and those responsibilities are the major things you need to learn one by one i'm going to describe it like uh, as a planning engineer you should be good in scheduling and planning what does mean by planning and scheduling Whenever companies like client, consultant and contractor, these are called specifically project parties. They are going to start any project like building construction project, pipeline project, petrochemical, refinery, oil and gas, any project. They need to plan that certain work with the time, different kind of windows that in this week we are going to define this uh, task. In this next week, we are going to do this task. So it's going on and on and on. It is going to comprise of two years of duration and all that. But how it will happen? That is project planning and control. First of all, you have to conduct scope management. You have to document all the work. Whatever you need to carry out on site area, like for the building construction, each and single task should be documented in that scope management. After this scope management, you have to implement a WBS strategy. You have to categorize your works as per the nature of that task like uh, maybe if i'm going to build a building road i have to categorize like substructure superstructure designing procurement construction within that construction i have to categorize further mep works civil works electrical works right so that is going to complete my scope management once this is going to done uh, i need to implement the logic the dependency model what work will be done on the first stage and what will be done on the uh, second stage okay finish to start relationships that's going to develop my dependency model and ultimately i am going to define activity durations like single activity like substructure like foundation like lean activity like excavation welding any single activity how much time it is going to consume how many resources i require for that certain activity and how many man hours i require for that so in that regard we need to discuss with boqs bill of quantities project resource productivity sheets and construction methodologies all these things are going to develop our certain and qualitative critical path method that is called your project scheduling and planning so once you are done with project scheduling and planning as a planning engineer you need to make different kind of primavera p6 features like how to format your project schedule how to use different kind of layouts how to use your group and sort by there are different options given in Primavera P6. You can uh, use uh, those features and extract required data from Primavera P6. You can make different kind of cost management plan, requirement management plans, next two weeks material requirement plans, and man hours requirement plans. So all these things are given in Primavera P6. As a project planning engineer, you are going to perform all these duties. So what is next? Once baseline is locked, once this document is done, you are okay with that you are going to review it with your team and you are going to submit this document which is called baseline to the consultant to the client for their approval if they are satisfied with this thing you are okay to go and uh, lock it in primavera p6 as approved baseline so next part is execution phase in the execution phase as a planning engineer you are going to collect data from site that what work is going on in terms of work done, how much excavation is done today? How much excavation is going to be done tomorrow? What is rate of production being done in the site area? Is it going okay? So you are going to produce different kind of progress reports. I mean, like you are going to show there how many quantities are being consumed, what is current progress, uh, what is earned value management analysis, like schedule variance, cost variance, schedule performance index, and cost performance index. With the Primavera P6 tool, it is very easy, but you have to understand basic logics like uh, Primavera P6 usage, different kind of features, project planning control concepts, product different stages like building, different milestones for building construction, road construction, uh, refinery, 
you should know product management as well, project management as well, and then Primavera P6. So these three things are going to help you to develop project schedules, different kind of reporting visuals, and how to analyze your data. And the fourth most important thing as a planning engineer that when your project is going to start, when your project is going to end, what are the payment methods? What are the different key milestones? What are the contractual milestones? So contract document is going to guide you in that regard. So you have to also familiar with contract documents as per as project planning control job is concerned. So if you are new in this field, like you are trying to grab this job career skill, you want to become in next two or three months, your target is to join any multinational company in building construction projects, road construction projects, power plants, refineries, oil and gas projects. Then you must join my upcoming session in which I'm going to guide you in very exclusive way. And this course is designed on my last 15 years of field experience, which I spent in Gulf regions while performing offshore and onshore projects in Abu Dhabi and Saudi Arabia. See you inside my upcoming session. Thank you very much.